is happening y'all welcome to skull and bones maybe if it connects so yes this is the from what i understand the second closed beta test um this game has been announced and sat around for like a while a lot of people weren't even sure if it was ever going to actually come out and apparently it comes out in like three months so yeah quick uh but we're gonna jump in check it out um Going in with no expectations here. I don't know if it's gonna be, uh, I don't know if it's gonna be like, you know, Sea of Thieves or, or what, I don't know. I know nothing about this other than it, uh, other than it initially started of as like them when wanting to do. As mighty as nations rule the seas. And dominate the world's valuable trade routes. Uh, there's volume. That's that's you, Greg. With an iron fist, you. They forge there is volume. Tyranny and exploitation, igniting a battle for global supremacy. From the Indian Ocean, a flood of exotic. Yeah, I think it was like AC Black Flag inspired, basically. With coins tainted in blood, and where there is blood, there are predators. Six months. Captain Rustler will have a tongue. We are meant to be his escort. Enough. There's been a battle here. The British have passed this way. I hope that's not what remains of the Hexagon Kako. Captainy, avoid the wreck ahead. Sailing a pirate ship, a pirate ship, a pirate ship. Pretty, uh, pretty weak start. That would have been nice to like throw me straight into a battle. Maybe it's about to happen. Kind of getting some some black flag vibes so far. So I think it uses. It looks like it's using like broadside cannons or other cannons based on the direction I'm facing. Bro, we are rapid firing. What is this? Pirate Call of Duty? Pretty chaotic. Yeah, so the front cannons are different. If I'm on the side, I get like a broad fire, broadside volley. I think that's what that line indicates. That's the like cross line. 
So if I cross over to here, I can do these cannons instead. Okay. Is a sponge, bro. How long does this go on? All right, we're gonna start tearing through its sails and stuff. Yeah, it's, uh, I don't know. Just kind of aim and shoot, aim and shoot, aim and shoot. That thing is beefy. This is go. I think all the cannons are on swivels or something. Or I don't know. My ship's kind of getting torn up. Like, how? Dude, what? I'm like one pirate ship versus like the entire English fleet. You do gotta lead your shots, so that's nice. It's the whole damn British fleet! What are we gonna do, Captain? Fire! Now! Ah, fire! I hope you'll enjoy the smoke! Am I supposed to just run, bro? They got mortars. Oh, what do you mean you failed us? I didn't, bro. Yeah, it seems very like power fantasy on ships so far. There's red weak points. I did not. I, did, I I saw red points, but they were like on top of the mast and whatnot. <laughs> now I make my dude. Oh my guy, he just like me, for real, for real. Yeah, he's got to be a little sunburnt. He's got he's a bit of a thick boy. Make him extra sunburnt, covered in scars. Oh, none of this matters. Half blind. Are we ever gonna see our person? I mean, like, I want the pirate mohawk. Where's the pirate mohawk? Uh, how do I do the uh, the hair color? Yeah, okay. Well, now facial hair. Give him a beard. Oh, I want, like, a, a beard. Probably like that. That's... No, that looks weird. 
The color blending does not look good. Very, uh... Let's do that. There we go. Uh, continue. Ready to rule the seas? Sure. Look, a survivor. Harry, the British fleet is still beneath. Take my hand. You're not dying today. Faith thrown you a twist, friend. Freeman's luck must truly be on your side. Luck? The British and the folk be them. I blame Captain Last for stealing us into these cursed shallows. <laughs> we survived the battle, and now you arrive to help crew the Dow. I would say our fortunes on the rise, no? There's a certain yearning in your eyes. I've seen the same glint in others before. I'm sure you will steer us true to Saint Anne. To reach Pirate Paradise. We must first know the way. Yeah. Favorite games of 2023. Armor Core, Baldur's Gate, Final Fantasy, Inkbound. And, uh... Dragon Quest Monsters, Dredge. 61 months between here and YouTube. It's the long time, Acres. Wait, are you... You're double... Jesus Christ, you double subbed. Maniac. Freeman's luck. Guide us. This is my pirate ship. Find a rope. Even faster. Trim the sails. I got a dinghy. This is my pirate dinghy. How do we, uh, how do we trim the sails? Oh, no, what is that? What am I doing? Land ahead. Destiny's thrown us a line. We can find help to get out of this place. She's getting beat. I told Captain Rassler the ship was as overburdened as a pregnant sow. We may have lost the British in the fog, but also the race against these cursed elements. See now, the Exeter's guts spilled across these shallows, and I'm surrounded by drunken sluggards who believe they are doomed to this hellish rock. And where were you, Captain? While the Exeter was hounded by British frigates. No doubt cowering in your quarters, like the filthy built rat you are. And what good are your foolhardy ways, if they have left us stranded upon these shallows? You wish to reach St. Anne? Of course you do. And so do the rest of this drunken lot, sprawled upon their asses. But if we return to the kingpin empty-handed, he will surely strip us of our title. Not sure so far. Still, still undecided if I'm feeling it or not. Retrieve what remains of Scalock's cargo from the shark-infested waters. Only then will I divulge the way to pirate paradise. I don't know. The initial combat impression was. Kind of spongy on the water. Okay. Yeah, I don't know. I think it's supposed to be like an MMO, but 
I'm, I'm not, I'm still, I'm still not entirely sure what this is. Wouldn't trust the officer to guide a fish in open seas. But if the bugger that shit's annoying. Group privacy, group privacy, group pri Like, I don't need that. That needs to go away. That's just big and intrusive. Those copses. We might have to search them. How do I, uh... We can hunt these fish for food. You must track fast! How do I change my camera? There we go. Jesus! I do not want to die today. Bro, just see the, the size of that what? shark. I think we have enough. I oh, cannot carry any more items. Okay. Yeah, I mean, Sea of Thieves is obviously the the main... Hang on, I gotta find a way to disable chat completely, because that is obnoxious. Interface, uh, text chat off. It's completely off, I don't want that. Oh, God, shark. Yeah, Sea of Thieves is, is the only real game I'm aware of that's, like, in this archetype. So, I, I guess we just, we fight and we loot. Plenty, so now I just deliver it. Okay. It's a little weird how it like checked off acquire and then it just added a different thing for her deliver. You wish the way to Saint Anne? Thanks for the goods. Skellock may well spare my head, but I cannot say the same for you. After I tell him about the captain who failed to protect his cargo. <laughs> Find your own way to St. Anne, chum sniffer. <laughs> I don't owe you a sliver up your ass, especially when mine's on the nice. line. Didn't he appreciate that? Homeless man stole lighter fuel from a cigarette store. He dropped now, most of the cans from the box. <laughs> what the hell? Oh, whoa. did you guys see that guy? What was that? It was going crazy. <laughs> A little weasel to the very end. If the bastard says Rassler might have the map to see an end, we should search his wreck. All right, that that thing is still up. How do I disable that completely? Honestly, right now the the uh, giant chat pop up on the interface is like super obnoxious. St. Anne's horizon might hold the sunrise I've been yearning for. Better hope the pirates don't stab you in the back first. Advance a step by aiming for a colored segment and pressing right trigger. Green zone returns optimal results. Uh, wait, what? What am I supposed to do? Force open. Oh, here we go. It's just 
on the ship. It definitely gives off like big starter quest MMO vibes. These load screens are also quite jarring. How do I fire it? Gotta aim it. The start of it's kind of given me, like, um, new world vibes. Just wandering around a shipwreck. Just a bunch of half-naked players wandering around. This comes out in February, so this is like two months away. I mean, initial impressions so far are, I don't, uh, I don't know, I don't know if I would play a lot of this. I mean, maybe it would be fun being pirates with the boys. I think that would be the, the big potential selling point here, but not really a fan of the, luck indeed. You found like, a way to I don't know, the start just doesn't, it's not a strong start at all. The kingpin will surely want to know what happened to his cargo. Or John Scarrow will have three shots from a flintlock wizard for our heads. Or just yours, friend. <laughs> What's a pirate's life without a little peril and mischief, eh? With the cargo from the Exeter lost, Scarlock will need a daring rogue like yourself to procure new goods for his pirate empire. And so far, your yeah, let's see. Has feared us true. So the I'm the day do, 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 do. Rassler is dead. And with him, all prior this is February 16th. You are free to make your own luck now. Banishers is 13th. That's probably going to be a YouTube series. Ultros is the 13th. I might stream that. Pacific Drive is late February. Sons of the Forest reaches full launch. Late February. And then obviously Rebirth at the end of February. Something tells me we're going to be just fine. Uh, compass. Hmm. So, so the, the way to center is marked on your compass. Imagine what else we could accomplish together, Captain. We could build a strong fleet and crush our enemies, conquer any threat. We could defy the gods themselves. Onwards to Saint Anne, Captain. <laughs> Elden Ring DLC isn't coming out. Not in the next three months, at least. Honestly, you shouldn't expect Elden Ring DLC till... Fuck. The earliest would be, like, summer. And even then... I don't know. Because if they were gonna announce- if they were gonna release Elden Ring DLC in February or March, they would have announced it at the Game Awards. So it's- it's gotta be- it's a chunk away. Probably six months or more. So far, it's just been like tutorial stuff, which has been pretty boring. I'm also curious to see, like, if this is like... Because I'm getting big MMO vibes. And I'm seeing a lot of ships. So... If this is like, here's your dinghy, 
and now you're gonna spend, you know, hours to get a big ship, that's gonna be a hard pass for me. Uh, I, we gotta see what the progression looks like and what we get to play. Because if it takes like, oh yeah, it's gonna take you about 15, 20 hours before you have an actual ship. Uh, yeah, I don't, I don't know about that. Yeah, I'm hoping they like, I want to see like a time skip and like, here's your starter ship. This actually can fight a little bit. Go do stuff. that be an easy pass? There's a difference between tiresome and, and uh, you know, lack of difficult. Like, ah, so do you want to sail around in a little, little dinghy for 10 hours? Throwing spears? The Indian Ocean holds many secrets and mysteries. The smuggling den of St. Anne is one of its hidden gems. Whatever a pirate needs, this place has it in stock. I played all six hours of the closed beta test and progression actually feels pretty organic so far. How far were you in uh, in six hours? Did you have like a good ship? Hey, don't look at me. You're the best pirate to win Skurlock over. Me? Aye. Jack, you can't be in my lap, buddy. Your nails are too sharp. We gotta cut those. We don't need Skurlock's loyalty to gain infamy and influence. Only his Shadows glitching out. A proper ship would be a start. Unless you want to keep cozying up on your Dao, I'll stay by the ship while you tread shore. Pay no mind to the bottom feeders, Captain. Remember, we answer only to the winds of fate. <laughs> You're gonna insist on being on my lap. I insist on clipping these razor blades you have for hands. Yeah, come here, Klaus. Hang on a second. Within days. Days? That carcass is just about falling apart. And reeks of wildness. Right, that should help. Manage to get like the five sharpest ones. And blueprints for ships from vendors in different ports. Said I reek like whale piss. It's too rude. There you go. How's that? Is that good, Jack? Is that good? Got those nails clipped. Now you can chill. So our swings about in a load. Just run around snatching stuff. You're one of the survivors from the shipwreck. Your situation must have improved if you're here for storage space. Lucky, your goods are safe here. More drags washed away. This one here survived the wreck. Sure looks like it. A survivor. Come on in, Callie. Get it done. We'll never show your ugly mug again. You useless git. The British wrecked my ship, sank my cargo, but shut you out. Hope you're not worthless. I really needed those goods. You see, this port rises on Chulin's patronage. And that merchant's so rich he pisses liquid gold. All I receive is a letter. That fucker wipes his ass to smear my face. I send a full haul of goods, and his demands triple. I need more captains. A proper pirate, I see. <laughs> well, you need a keen eye for prizes. And a lot more guns. Yeah, it looks like silent protagonist. Cully. I saw that little tub you washed up in. It's halfway to Flotsam. You got spirits, but you're not ready yet. And you want to get out of those rags and into a real ship, then build your reputation. 
and earn the people's respect. Good things will follow. Do that, and I can make you the most infamous pirate in all the seas. And off you go. We'll see each other soon. Okay, infamy. Services and contracts will become available. The tougher the challenge, the more infamy. Uh. Okay. Never trust another pirate. It's running like his feet hurt. So you're the kelp that washed ashore from the wreck of the Exeter. Skellock may see potential in you, but all I see is a would-be pirate with salt in their breeches. Tell me, what does the pirate king see in someone as ragged as yourself? Careful your determination is not steered by Skellock, but by your own free will. Cunning is a pirate's true compass. Remember that. I expect you'll be wanting a pet on the back, treasure in your boots, and John Skellock's warm embrace. Ha! Saint Anne would sooner slit your throat than be called in paradise. I can build you the mightiest ship in the Indian Ocean, like I did for Skellock with his Margareta. But how you steer it into the waves is up to you, Captain. Okay. Mm a pirate steers their own ship, but how it fares... In I don't know the next time I'll be doing Avatar. There's a lot of games on deck I'm playing right now. And he will help you craft the tools. We wanted to check out this before the closed beta ended. I want to check out uh, Rogue Trader. I want to do more God of War. A lot of stuff to do right now. You have been floating on a splinter of luck. You are eager, and we can help each other. You bring me what? Uh, okay, so... You should visit the African coast. Asante, see you then. VP, do you need more from me? The sea is most beautiful near Makisiwa. That's all just garbage I have. Maybe we can do business again. Check your map to locate resources. Pretty sure I did Blood West. Got a bigger ship ready, Captain. I don't want to have to haul you from the sea again. Uh. Hey, Captain, you going aboard? All right. Uh, we marked everything. Wait. All right. So I want to select all marked. Oh, hang on. There we go. Kind of like the cartoonish map. Get moving, you rascals! Just around the bay, we can go get some trees. Dude's got a bigger, bigger ship. That's probably like my starter ship. I gotta go gather up some trees and shit first.
if I mark... Oh, nice, it does create a thing. Do I, uh... How do I disembark? Uh... But you harvest from the boat? Wait, what? Construct your first ship. How? Do I need to like, do I throw my spear at the tree? Like what? How do I, how do I harvest? It's not, doesn't really. Oh, the trees are cut down. Okay. I see, I see. Under under attack or something? Is there somebody? Uh, well, there is, but they're way over there. They're probably not a concern. They're probably just as confused as I was trying to figure out what the hell to do. Getting extra wood, lady. Yeah, so it just pops up and then you... Okay, so the harvesting is easy. <clears throat> Curly, I ain't, I ain't giving this a review score, man. I've been playing it for 40 minutes. First 30 minutes of a game, you can figure out if you hate it or not. Whether or not it's a good game or you like it, that's a whole different story. Pop up is. Oh, how we got fixed it. <clears throat> yeah, definitely agree. Not not a very. <clears throat> like the first tree, the, there should have been some dialogue that popped up. Like. Look alive to your battle station. 
mean, when I first showed up, there should have been something like, This node's already harvested. Uh oh, is it a gator? A gator wants to eat me. Oh my god. Bro, this crocodile's jumping up to bite my boat. The fucking menace these are. Spent 10 minutes sitting in empty notes. Yeah, right? Like, if somebody didn't mention something. I would have been confused, and eventually I would have been like, alright, let's just leave. But yeah, they're definitely, they, they need to have some kind of dialogue that pops up, like a, you know. Captain, this node's harvest, let's move forward. You know, something to inform the player. Because it's not clear. Like, once it, once the harvest prompt pops up, yeah, it's easy. But, and for like... For the 30 seconds before you realize that, it's a very awkward pause. I'm pretty sure this game is just all PvP. I think that's the, uh, pretty sure that's the whole appeal. Deliver. PvE opt-in PvP? Why would you want to not play PvP? Then we can do I was worried you would not make it back. Continue like this, mate, and fortune will surely come your way. You are one step closer to securing your own vessel. Thank you. Come back again. It's gonna be get more wood, but I already vessel? got it, bro. You have come many leagues since searching for scraps on the coast. If you have the silver, I will gladly sell you designs stolen from mercantile dogs. With the right materials, you can build a ship to rival their best. That rude gaming coming in with the two month. Take good care of your ship. Uh. Where's the warehouse? These are like bounties. Be worthy ship. Craft a uh, Badar at the shipwright. If Skerlock vouches for you, then we can do business. Rammer. Small maneuverable ship that can ram targets and cause flooding damage. Increase damage from ramming by 25%. Reduce slowing effect of torn sails by 50%. Okay. Uh, require cost. Craft it. Nice. I mean, all you gotta do is you just, you make it like until players are, are level 10, you know, they're, they're safe or something. Until you've crafted your first Bedar, you're safe from other players. You know, have a have a baseline ship, and then have it in like tiers or something. Ha! Look at that! 
that? A ship to call your own and a shoreline calling to good fortunes. Speak to Thomas, the blacksmith, next. Like, levels... I don't, I don't know if this game has levels, but like, you know... Tier 5 ships can only attack other... Or, or make it so like your ships are tiers, so like a tier 1 could only attack like... <clears throat> tier 1 or tier 2. And a tier 2 could only attack... A tier 2, a tier 3, or a tier 1. And like a tier 5 would only be attacked by like another tier 5, but they could attack higher if they wanted or something, I don't know. But yeah, opt-in PvP on a pirate game is a little weird, I think. Listen, surviving in part, the extra crash has left bring me sub. Before you can take a point out of the company, you need to have you need provision. Don't go drowning in a mud puddle. I might have the stuff he needs. Let me see. Day, uh, craft over and bog iron. You have 16. Cool. We have all kinds of different cannons and stuff. So what? Damn trumpets. Contains 100 cannonballs. Uh, am I broke? Why can't I? Oh, blueprint already owned. Okay. Devils and blacksmiths like fire. Uh, cannonballs. These furry cannons—they'll pierce through those dainty com. I just want to get into some like actual combat, and that's gonna be a uh, so, you the, the metric for whether I'm enjoying this or not. Arm your ship with your newly created cannons. Equipment at the dock before setting sail. Owner, is there any reason for me to like not store everything? Anywhere in the den, use the Manage Ship menu to customize weapons, furniture, cosmetics, and equip your cannons. So, like, I want to bring that and that. Increase acceleration. Okay, cool. And then repair kits I want. Increase stamina. So, I'll pull. Pull out the fish. The contract item. It's like stuff to trade. Okay, so... Three different weapons. Thomas the blacksmith is picky with his customers. One, One major furniture. Right. Oh cool, I can color it. I can finish up around here, Captain. Bunch of cosmetic stuff. Uh, the Booty Plunderer. Man, come on! How is Booty Profanity? The Penetrator. What?! Bro! <laughs> the fuck?! Um Don't forget to get us enough repair kits. Clapper, I don't know. Bro, I I tried to I can't believe booty is a banned word. How are you going to have booty be blocked for profanity 
in a game where they tell you to go get booty. Repair. Ship health is full. Shit is whack. What am I? What are my contracts? I... Destroy gatherer ships that can be found in. I just. Be soft. Yeah, right. Pirate battle. Har har har! This, this looks like his ship's not even taking damage, dude. All right, crew board. Did I get all the loot? <clears throat> I was just mashing Y. I guess I did. There is kind of a story. Get ya. Yeah, this is a ship built for. I mean, I am getting a, some some uh, some black flag vibes. I can call for help. I'm gonna kill them all. I don't understand what triggers the boarding. Oh, 
Everyone on deck to Battle Station! Place yourselves, people! Hook, line, and sinker! The combat is like now that I'm I'm doing it, it is very uh very black flagish. Taking out ships is pretty easy. To board, you have to get really close. Is there any advantage to boarding? Can I, like, take the ship? Yo ho, yo ho, a pirate's life for me. Oh, they're dead. Alright, so I just need to, like, ram it and then just chill next to it and it'll tick down to where I can board it, basically. Gotta go! Oh, I should not have picked a fight with these dudes. I'm probably dead. Yeah. So what happens when we die? Voyage ending. Ship shrunk by Nakoya. Respawn at sea. Repair and return to action for 117. Or back to dock. Okay. Well, it's nice you can just respawn at sea for a price. Your cargo will be jettisoned. Return to where you were sunk to recover it before it's claimed. This is marked on other map. Be careful if you're sunk again. It'll be lost forever. Guys, it's a souls-like! Do you see that? If I die before getting back, it's gone! It's a souls-like! Pirate souls! The ship does a dodge roll! I think that makes sense though. You die, you drop all your loot, and if somebody else gets it before you get back, too tough shit. That's cool.
I'd almost rather just like not even have the uh, the in-person part. Just like let me manage all this from a fucking menu and get back out to sea. I'll build you a fine weapon. Those frogs barely put up a fight, eh? Now you've impressed the. I'm a scoundrel now. This see. Yeah, like I like how Dredge did it. Yeah, I don't gotta get off and explore the island. It's just there's stuff to do. Utility furniture, major furniture, repair kit. Where do I get the uh, the blueprint for a repair kit? You got that? Freedom is not given. A pirate must steal it. I am always here. Crew stamina, okay. Oh, oh my god, how many coconuts do I have, dude? Holy shit! 45? Bro, I'm the coconut master. As far as I know, I don't think you can dive at all. Acquire cogwheel. Optional. Acquire Colburn. Welcome, Capitan. Am I to drill? And by that, I mean. <laughs> These hands. Can I refine most ranks. Cast iron, cast acuplank. Okay, so I go to her to use the shit, and then with that I can make bigger boats. All right, it's growing on me. It's definitely, it's definitely growing on me. The on person is still fucking goofy, but the the core loop here of Get stuff, make better ship, do quests is uh Let's make good on this chance. I am I am uh I'm enjoying that so far. A bunch of coconut. Transfer all of it to the warehouse. Uh mark you, I need my cannonballs. Coconut. Definitely a couple like little shader issues here and there. I wonder what's uh what is NVIDIA overlay? But well, getting close to a ship that has been heavily damaged and vulnerable crew attacks just from a crew boarding, the shield's more loot be beyond that revealed on spyglass, exclusive items and equipment. Press Y to pull a vulnerable enemy ship in with your grappling hook. So if you're successful, you execute a crew boarding. Uh settings. Graphics. Ultra high. Adaptive is off, ultra high, quality high. I mean, it seems smooth. I would like to, is there a FPS tracker? FPS limit. It's using not that much. I want to know what my frames are. Disables the timing gameplay associated instead will be slower but automatically harvesting them. That's kind of nice.
So where are we going? Out into the sea. With this wind, we are uh, that is up there. I must aim. Left stick pulls up chat. That does that. Right stick's that. That's brace. How do I... I think that eats. How do I eat? How do I... Uh, select. Eat. I think there's there's probably like something I can press to like how how what was the quick wheel? There we go. X was the quick wheel. So play a shanty. Cooked food. Water flask. Photo mode. Toggle primary camera. Toggle rear camera. Yeah, I'm not sure what the purpose of the crow's nest is. Like, look at that! <coughs> the whole game of boating from AC4. There's like a progression, but yeah, you kind of got the idea. Ship. Take all their goods. Take it all, lads. Take everything they're worth. Give nothing back. Yeah, I'd, I'd probably do some pirate shit with the boys I bet uh I bet Rom would have some fun with this I mean I like the combat in this a lot more than uh than Sea of Thieves Sea of Thieves I played a couple times and the big thing that always I just couldn't get on board with was the uh just the combat felt very uh very janky in Sea of Thieves. Oh, so you gotta be... Okay, I see. You gotta be, like, right on top of them when you hit the button. You gotta be close enough that you can hook him. Okay. Come on, get him. I got one. Eye frames, bitch. Starboard is the right side of the ship when you're facing forward. And an easy way to remember this is port has four letters, the same as left. Therefore, port and starboard.
I will say I like that, uh... So the start of the game, the, st the, the very start, definitely gave a poor impression of the combat, I feel. Is the start of the start of the game made it seem like everything was super fucking spongy. And that's definitely not the case. Combat is actually very fast paced. At least early on. But yeah, the the very opening the opening of the game made it seem like we were doing uh you know like it's just it looked like it had insane time to kill windows like we were gonna be fighting and fighting and fighting and fighting and I'm like this ain't good something to eat I mean you can disable the harvesting minigame if you hate it All right. I'm gonna go grab some food to snack on I'll be right back My wife's actually having a, a party, like a little party with like her mom and her aunt and some other family members. I just pillaged all their food. Got like a fruit tart, little uh, chicken salad sandwich thing, meat and cheese. It's a good pirate haul. Grabbed a plate, was like, mine, mine, mine. Mm. Mm. Are you fat and swollen? What? Do I look swollen to you or something?
Oh, the dude with the knee. <laughs> say, like, what are you talking about, bro? Your infamy rises. So I cooked this. Oh no, so these are proper meals. I gotta find flour. I've heard enough about you to know you'll do a decent job ferrying wares. What say you work for Tatamu? My connections in your ship will net us more coin than there are fish in the sea. You are greedy as a shark on the scent of blood. I think we'll get along fine. If you are willing, then heed my advice. Buy wares from me and sell them elsewhere for a profit. As long as I get a cut, we have a deal. Leave the information and contact details to me. Some routes are too dangerous. So I buy this, and then I go somewhere and sell it. So like I'm playing a trader in um, Elite Dangerous or something. If metal work is what you need, my anvil's ready. I thought you'd wilt. Thought you'd cower. But you've proven me dead wrong, mate. You butchered comp. People don't know me, and that's the way I like it. Reload six seconds. Reload three point five. Range is two fifty. Range is six hundred. This doesn't make sense. I love the sound of bending steel. All right, hang on. This part's a little confusing here. So, cannonballs. The damage is going to be 500. I'll grab a screenshot of this. Is it the damage summary that's that's messed up? Damage per shot, 500, okay? <clears throat> I go to the demi cannon. <clears throat> the reload is 3.5, which is less than the reload of 6. And the range is only 250 meters compared to 600 meter. But it would suggest that it has better range because it's green, but worse reload because it's red. That doesn't make sense to me. Damage per shot is higher. And projectile speed is also better. 150, 210, all size. I could use a drink. The comparison thing isn't very clear at all. Because the damage per shot is lower. But it has a better projectile speed. Hmm. You tormented the compagnie, rose in infamy, and earned the respect of your fellow pirates. But you look like shite, mate. Seek out Florentine at the Atelier and she'll garb you up good. Mm. So, fruit tart's good. Hey, 
Here for restyle, mon coeur? I can tell from a glance you're not a normal pirate. Come, Florentine D'Alesso will turn your life around with fashion to fit your rising fame. Do a little fashion souls in. Hmm. You broke the never eat on camera into the microphone rule? That ain't a rule. I'll eat whenever the fuck I want. If you don't like it, leave. Tricon hearts are a necessity. I kind of like the sanguine set. I like that one too. That's pretty cool. Oh, I'm chill. I'm just making it. Listen, when I, let me make something very clear. If I curse, that doesn't mean I'm upset. Okay, that's just how people from the north are. If you say something dumb and I call you a fucking idiot, my that doesn't mean, oh my god, Cowboy's mad, he needs to chill. No, it just it just means you're a fucking idiot, that's all. I think y'all have legit seen me mad, like, maybe twice ever on the channel. Like, I don't, I don't get angry. It takes a lot to get me angry. And usually it's when I'm drunk. But yeah, people telling me not to eat on stream, just suck my balls. Don't care. Absolutely do not give a fuck. Mm, kind of like the black. This one's a little too edgy. I need an umbrella. Mm -hmm. Going this one. Okay, it says blockade runner, purchasable at vendors. So do I need to... Wait, what? Oh, 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 okay. So... Now that I've... What does the switch view do? I miss cake. Very random. So this is... Alright, something's not working right. So I hit A... It pulled up this, and it's like, here's the, the stuff you want to buy for this. But if I go to this one, and I hit A, nothing happens. It's not pulling up the set. So I'm going to have to, like, manually make it, I think. Vera thoroughly needs a restyle. Ugh. What was it? I saw you angry at the Stranger at Paradise laser puzzle. I don't even remember that one. Laser puzzle. Laser puzzle. I don't know. I don't know that one. I don't remember the laser puzzle. Oh, wait, when the laser was just insta-killing me? Yeah, that shit was whack. I would say that's, that's heated. I don't... I, I wouldn't say that was angry. My hair has had better days. I was I was getting a little heated, but I wouldn't I wouldn't constitute that as angry. Ooh, kingpin for the dappled leather. Funny looking hat. Man, I'd be spending all my money. How about this guy? It's only that one's not as as expensive. We can we can buy this one. It's like a good. That's a good a good starter pirate hat. I don't need a face accessory. I do need a, a torso. We're just gonna make that that look. I need some boots. My ass been barefoot forever.
Hmm. It's a lot of money. We need some pants too. Oh yeah, let's go good. There we go. We got the swag. Don't look homeless anymore. Look if Cowboy was genuinely angry, he just cut off stream. Probably. As your reputation grows, remember to ensure your style keeps up. Like I said, I don't really I don't really get like genuinely angry playing games. Cause before I would get like super angry at something, I would just stop playing it and do something else that's fun that doesn't make me angry. I'll build you a fine weapon. So you've been to the atelier. If you want to rise above the rest, if any posed I will say I don't give a shit about the dialogue. I'm like skip 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 skip. Put me back into the water, baby. Remember, we never talked. Tracking a blueprint that you own, you can easily view the materials required to craft. Also, visit location of all remaining materials on the map. Okay. Check the map inside your logbook. All right, and now I go to knowledge. There's the tutorial. Check the map. Journal. Uh, this page shows all of your currently tracked blueprints. The cutter. Track. Uh, bronze ingot, Iroko plank, fine jute, and silver. I need money. Bronze ingot. I think I can... No, sea monsters? Nah, nothing like that. Okay. I, I doubt we'll see sea monsters in the, the beta. Scoundrel chest. Visions, where is the, this person? No. This person. I think. Bronze ingot, Roko plank. I need the, uh, this, you, you're the refinery, okay. Skurlock has taken a fancy to your mug. Watch yourself. I need Roko wood to make planks, to make bronze ingots. I need copper. Best so I ain't got anything. If you're quite done, I've got work to do. Where's the uh, where's the warehouse? Pirate King, that's the cook. Shipwright, refinery, cook, blacksmith. How do I access my warehouse? I guess I could just go by the boat oh, next to the mail. Mail was. Are you just ah yes the warehouse. The box icon. I want to access my warehouse. Ooh, a bombarder. And uh, some other stuff. Repair kit, repair kit tier two cannonballs. Come back anytime. Right, let's go talk to pirate dude real fast. I think I'm gonna go hunt down the stuff for my cutter. Hey, better watch your ma thanks to cutter. You see my say make pat as long as that. You seek fortune with Zilla. You want this chat? I want you to horse at a seat they have been locked. I don't care who wins. Some of the seat will just so. Go. 
go. No bombardment in this town. Rip. Oh, well, we'll shove it back in. Uh, I'd rather do cutter. I'd rather go hunt down that stuff. So long as the sea people remain at war. Manage cargo. Sort you to the warehouse. Weapons. The sea calls, Captain. Shall we answer? Faster reload. I could do bombard on the ship. Bombard on the front. Demi cannons. Let's do demi cannons on the starboard side. Edit name. So is, is booty? Seriously? That's so whack, bro. Let's just name it the cowboy. Oh no, I don't have bombard bombs. Womp womp. Well, in that case, let me go. Let me put the demi cannon up front and then the regular cannons on the starboard. Oh, it looks like it redeposited it. That's good. Does Demi Cannon also just use regular cannonballs? I hope it does. What's that little icon? Explosive. We're gonna go get the stuff we need for a new ship. Browns didn't get Iroko Plank. Damn, that's out there. That's what is this? Skullock's allies are in short supply these days. Give the sea people his weapons, and they'll sing like canaries. What is that here? This feels like it's a camp. That's a settlement. What is this? What is this? Cast iron ingot. Uh, can I even get the stuff I want? Rich and well defended place of trade. Raid or trade, okay. Let's go. We are gonna try to not die. Showed how long, where was the, the thing that said how long we have to play? What happens if I hit plunder? I'll be bad stuff happens. There we go, four and a half hours.
I wonder how many people are just gonna sail around in like <clears throat> dinky dinky little ships and then they'll just like snatch up stuff that like look for fights and then snatch up stuff as people die. So we gotta just find ships around here that have bronze ingots, Iroko planks, and silver. It's not forced PvP casual, which is quite unfortunate if we're being honest. So would I have to plunder this place to get the stuff I want? Because I'm level one, this place is level three. And trade them or plunder. I mean, I guess, let's try and plunder. It's probably gonna end poorly, but. Oh, someone plundered it already. That's okay, so that means I can't plunder yet. World event active. Oh, cool, there's like world events that'll happen. I mean, it's, it's repairing. I don't think I can... I'm pretty sure I can't plunder with it right now. I gotta wait till that little... That circle fills up and then I can probably try and plunder it. And trading's not gonna happen because I ain't got any money. I spent all the money I had on clothing. Which was kind of dumb. But it's a beta, so who cares. Bronze ingots. Yeah, they want a hundred. That's six hundred for that. I need five hundred for that. I ain't got that money. Your name should echo loud. Oh, they're looking for ale. Don't let his tails eclipse your own. I got some snuff and uh cogwheel. And some I got some amber, Chris. Plunder them! Ready, 
Bro, it's like a tower shooting at me. Destroy all enemies to resume the plunder. I gotta, do I gotta take out those towers? Is this like a timed event? Crew is in no condition to sing. We're in battle. We can't be singing. Yeah, so it looks like two towers and that one ship. I killed the ship. We're sailing around. We'll hit them from the back, boys. Seems like it can't attack me here, so we're just gonna chill. Plunder cheese! This is what you get for only putting cannons in the front. No, no! Fire! Standing by! Good as new, Captain. Oh, they, they finally rotated their cannons around to shoot me. A little bit late. Uno mas. Alright, I gotta take out this tower. That's definitely a broadside type thing. The, the weak point on this thing isn't very clear to me. Like that part's red, but I feel like I'm not hitting very strong damage on it. I know I am. I'm hitting 751. They're just that strong. Yeah, I just need to- I need to stay out of this thing's range or I'm gonna die. Bro, I'm trying! Turn the ship! Turn the ship! Oh, it's absolutely a level difference thing. I'm level one, 
This thing is level three. So like, yeah, I, I don't belong here. But we're, uh, you know, we're trying to get, get stuff, so. Best bet is gonna be me like circling a bunch like this. No, bro, I'm gonna die. Oh god, we got it. I found cannonballs. Man, I'm not finding the shit I wanted out here. I gotta go. There's a proper ship that's coming in that's gonna... Oh, wait, hang on. There's, like, loot. If I catch you slacking, I'll take your fucking car. Oh, we got a re re respawn thingy. The towers are super hard. another ship that's showing up I think it's that one that's sailing in right now Captain, look! where is it that level two guy that <laughs> dude is that who we're up against I gotta get a good ram on him. Yeah, here we go. Bro, I am getting by by a thread right now. I should have brought more healing. the final part. One ship. One more ship and I'm good. Oh shit, it's a level three though? Bro, do I just leave? Or do I... I'll probably die here though. If I had one heal, I could pull this off. <sighs> Shit, I fucked up. Oh, we're, we're, I'm probably dead here. Wait, is that the boarding icon? Oh god, hang on. This is it. This is it. If I can... Oh, 
No, 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 no. Hang on. I gotta turn it. I gotta turn it. Oh my god, we got it. Holy shit, dude. Oh, that was stressful. It's a closed beta, so you're either invited or that's it. Alright, bro, I need to go back to base. I need to go back to base. Uh, I got everything I need except for the bronze ingots. Wait. Did I did I get money from that too? How do I see my money? Yeah, I can buy the last two I need. Hi, I just raided you. I'm now here to buy things. Kits. And then I needed bronze ingots. I probably need more fucking cannonballs, too. Alright. What is this? The fuck? What's the red thing? What is the red icon? Get moving, you rascals. If you just raided that place, you should be able to take all that for free. <laughs> I mean, I got if I got what I want. I'm making my my cutter. I hope I fed Benjamin with food and on other ships. The seas have tried to clean me more than once. I'm just gonna keep on healing ourselves. Thoughts so far are potentially good. So the ship combat is tight. Uh, big, big black flag vibes, but with less uh, like power fantasy. You know, like black flag, when you'd go to ram a ship, you're like, Poof! you would like boost up and slam into them. You can still ram. We have different types of cannons, uh, but things aren't like as outright busted as they were in black flag. Uh... Shanties are good. Sailing is good. Not a giant fan of the mini games, but they're not terrible. Uh, the big thing right now, the biggest thing I didn't like was getting off on the boat. I think you could do all that from, uh, you could do all that from just on the boat. I don't think I need to actually get off the boat, but whatever. It's not, it's not terrible. It's not burdensome. It's just kind of like, you know, it almost feels unnecessary, I guess. I do think it would be significantly better with friends running around and murdering and looting. Um, performance is really good so far. I haven't had any hiccups on PC. Everything's been smooth. Graphics obviously look good. The sound of the cannons is just very... Uh, very boom. Oh. Oh, we're going back home first. So far, I think there's there's good potential here. I would I would uh initial impressions put this at like a four out of five. Alright, 
is that another treasure map? I mean, well, it's an ocean, bro. Ocean water isn't supposed to be, like, vibrant. Not out in the depths. I guarantee this game will be twenty dollars within two weeks because it comes out mid-February. Aiming five hundred better games, and then I will play it. I guarantee you're out of your fucking mind if you think this is gonna drop down and be twenty dollars within two weeks. There's a bigger chance of your mom opening up my office right now and dropping to her knees, giving me a blowjob live on stream, than there is of Ubisoft dropping this game to $20 in two weeks. You show metal, young knight. AC Mirage came out in October and was not very well received. And that was two months ago. You said two weeks. Crowbar. Ooh, that's good. I escaped to St. Anne, where I begged on the streets. Actually, I'm pretty sure it's not. AC Mirage right now is 35. I don't know where you're getting 20 from. For storage needs, come again. I don't think Mirage would mean it. For when it came out, Mirage wasn't very well received. AC Mirage. The Metacritic average is like a 75. Which releasing in one of the busiest times of the year a 75 is a eh i might play it it's not a game that's that's winning any rewards i'm gonna go do that i'll check out treasure maps i'll do all that stuff i want to make my new boat first that leaky top of yours. Rammer. Small maneuverable ship that rams target causes flooding damage. Sentinel. It's a cutter class. Supporting other ships in the thick of combat. Specialized in aiding friendly ships. The support excels in providing assets. Reduce severe damage by one health and hull health by 0.5%. Oh, it restores hull health by 0.5%. That's kind of cool. What did I get the the blueprint for? What did I get the blueprint for? Thank you. Come back again. A cutter. You're treading water, Captain. So it is this. It's the Sentinel ship. So I lose out on ramming. Sloops are popular among pirates. I mean, it's still a small ship. Let me. I want to look at my my stats. Oh, hang on, let me, uh... So, loadout potential, bow and broadsides. Base ship rank 1. Okay, let me give grab a quick screenshot of this. Nope, hang on, I went up too high. I wish I could just expand this, make this bigger. All right, so comparing it. So hull health is less, 2100. Brace strength is less at 42. Speed is 9 and 13 compared to 8 and 12. Cargo is much higher. Stamina is about the same. 
It also has bow and broadsides. So the biggest thing here is, is this restores severe damage by 1% and whole health by half a percent per second. Restores whole health of all friendly ships in a 100 meter radius of a repaired target by 1%. Restore 60% more of whole health on a friendly ship while using a repair weapon. Huh. I don't know if I really... Yeah, no, it absolutely needs a compare. I don't know if I... Uh, I don't know how I feel about that. I mean, this is this is clearly... If I was playing with friends, it would be a, a solid ship. But for solo... No. Ship right. I want some ship designs. Dar. Oh, you sell the blueprint for that. I don't need that. I own that. Hurry before your ship sails away. You can craft those other ships or your track them. Water, well, that means cutthroat, corsair, brigand, buccaneer. And this is a blueprint. Reduce brace strength depletion by 20% when hit. Funny word for a boat. This is a thick boy and it has stern as well. But it goes a bit slower. I want this. Defender. Track blueprint. Found in the Red Isle. Purchasable from Fair Warrior and Sacred Tree. Thank you. Come Let's go. Let's go get it. We're going to go get the Hulk ship. Damn, you went there. Shut you right the fuck down. Everyone's got hit on Ubisoft. A lot of that. Stop judging games like score reviews. Play yourself. Wait, what happened? If you keep coming back, I'll have to read your story. Uh, let me see. Mark, Mark, Mark. I'd like to sell again. In Zanjao. 300 cannonballs, some grilled bread, coconut. Some commodities. All right. Your goods. Safe here. Tier tool, tools, and mortar ammo now. Ooh. Crate of used weapons meant for the sea people. Oh, it's a contract item. If you keep coming back, I'll have to read your story. Come back anytime. I thought I had the rope thingy on my, my boat. Let's see. <clears throat> is, this, is this my mark? Right, what is this? Why are you not popping up? Brokered ground. Okay, it's a quest over there. Blueprint is over there for the defender. Dock here to unlock a fast travel point. Ooh. Let's go over there and then we'll... Let's not push our luck. Manage cargo. Wait, hang on, manage ship. So long as the sea people remain at war, Skurlock rakes in the profits. Area of effect. Oh, I don't have bombard, so ain't no point in doing that right now. Uh, you should be normal cannons. You, uh, the side cannons should be the demi. And then I need more repair kits. <clears throat> Uh, I can craft those. And there's the bounty. I want to get the bounty too. Uh, 
I will improve your ship. Tell me what you need. No scavenged wood. Bye. Long gone. <clears throat> mm. Working with my hands is relaxing. Wait, long gun. Oh, that's a. Never mind. I thought that was for a long gun. It's for a, a thing. Maybe we can do business again. What's up, Jack? Do you want to leave? I could craft whatever you need. Got any designs for me? Uh, you do not own the required blueprint. I can track it. Enhanced. Requires a higher rank. Found in Red Isle. Purchasable from the Sea People Huntsmaster. Ooh. Want to get that for sure. Long gun. <clears throat> found in Red Isle. All the all the stuff I want is found in Red Isle. They're a warrior at the Sacred Tree. Sea People Merchant of Verona Falls. Blacksmith in St. Anne. Oh, so he just sells that. Sea People Huntsmaster and Lantira. And see people merchant in Verona Falls. Jack, come on. If you're gonna just keep stop. Long guns sound nice. So I can snipe and then if they get close, hit them with the other thing. Uh so I wanna track this. And I wanna track this. I just remember Sea per Sea People Merchant and Sea People Huntsmaster. Let me just write this down. Uh Sea People Huntmaster and Lanteria. And Sea People Merchant Verona Falls. That's right, I needed to craft repair kits. Can I craft those with him? Here, that was quick. You must have joined my surly company then. Armor. Right, what is this? <clears throat> this is armor I can put on my, my ship to increase its overall strength. That's kind of cool. A pirate needs steel nerves. Oh, weapons, auxiliary weapons. So wait, where do I get my, uh, the hell? In a mud puddle. So the refinery, where do I make my repair kits at? I don't think it was you. I heard your name twice now while sailors drown in rum. What have you been up to? Fare you well, Capitan. Wasn't the ship right? Where the hell do I get him? The carpenter? More from me? Yes. My sister was strong and more found in Red Isle from the I Sea People. So. Okay, well, I gotta make. Uh... No, I don't have the scavenged wood. Can I break stuff down into scavenged wood? Asante. Oh, 
Well, I'd like to just craft them if possible, because, you know, money. Do you need more from me? <sighs> and no, he sells the repair kit. He doesn't sell the. He sells the the um, the blueprint, which I don't need the blueprint. I need the actual repair kits. I am always here. Yeah, you commodity trader. So this little anchovy grew a fin, hey? I heard them speak of you like a vicious shark. No, not you. Time spent talking is money lost. If they raise the price of running, I'm a quick <laughs> Welcome to Mako Lacey's provision shop, Skipper. Buy or sell food, I'm your lass. Parakit tier to two. Me, I'll bite your head off like a Mako shark. Otherwise. I'm a bucket of sunshine. Stock up on repair for provisions. Mako Lacey's the name. Hey, Captain. Going aboard? Yeah, the code to play closed beta a few months ago, uh, and it was hard to play because they watermarked the screen with the gamer tag. Yeah, that's that's how. NDA closed betas work. They make sure you're not going to stream it. That's, that's standard. Alright, let's go out to the sea people, try and get some stiff. Where was the... shit. Hang on a second. What was I... That did knowledge. What was the thing I was tracking? Over hell. Those are the treasure maps. The Hulk was out there. Uh, sea people in Lantira and in Verona Falls. Isn't this Verona Falls right here? All right, let's just go over there. Wait, didn't I just, did I not track it? I did. I want to get better guns. Now this is this is one of the places I need, and then the other one is in Lenitra, wherever that's at. Look at that, the ship has more cannons than us. We're gonna try and sell some stuff, make some money, buy a blueprint. Honestly, the biggest downside of this game right now is just the, uh, the, like, load screens. I'd rather see, like, actual transitions, but... I do. I do come seeking trade. That is good to hear. 
Forgive us for being with. We are at war with the clan of Bab. If you are not an agent of the Farak. You Oh no, those are repair kit twos. No, hang on. He doesn't have oh that's bombardment ammo. Bombardment sound good. Damn, I would go broke. That's that's fine. See people merchant at Verona Falls. That's the leader. I need the merchant here. Who is the Who is the merchant? Anything useful? Like Mr. Sticky Fingers over here. I'm just snatching everything I see. I have wares for trade. Brokered ground. It said the Sea People Merchant at Verona Falls. Who is the Sea? Is the who's the merchant here? Over this way. Yes. Hello. Hello. Oh, you got all kinds of shit. Damn. All right. Let me see. Long gun tier two. That's what I want. Veluma. All right. So let me see about. I remember I saw something about fast travel. Oh, fast traveling costs money, and my ass is broke. Yes, the game has a story. VS, I'm gonna be honest, it sounds like you're just here to bitch about the game, bro. If you're not liking it that much... Maybe this ain't the same for you, man. A couple of y'all been been extra bitch tonight. I know I know Ubisoft has a uh, a history of banging your moms, but you don't need to bring that bad juju here. I like that I can see what all this shit is before I uh, take it. That's nice. May we meet again? All captain, we setting off. I'd say it's fair to be skeptical of Ubisoft after nonstop below mediocre releases for the past few years. All right, I don't know about below mediocre releases, but. Regardless, the point is, you can be skeptical without acting like a twat. Alright? Being skeptical is coming in and being like, I wonder how this is, how, how, you know, oh, this is, this is interesting, or oh, no, it's not for me, or, you know, hey, I'm just here to see if the game's good or not, see if it's, it's something I want. Just coming in the chat and being like, Lamau, Ubisoft bad, Lamau, Lamau, Ubisoft so bad, mid, super mid, Lamau game big mid, like, that's, that's not fucking contributing anything other than you acting like an idiot. 
which is a, a general theme with certain if it's an ea game or it's a ubisoft game i can always count on somebody coming in chat and being like because they got no fucking internal thought process they just have to spew the shit that pours out of their mouth It's like critical thinking is a lost fucking skill of this generation. What did you think about the game? What did you like about it? Uh, game mid. What does that mean? Game mid. Can you elaborate on, on what you think makes it mid? Game mid. Nobody got time for that. You itching to deal with John Skurlock, hmm? I'm itching to make some of these long guns. Oh, what do I need? Wood tar. Wood tar. Looks like I get those from certain people. Wood tar. It's a top deck weapon, so it's like I snipe them while they're far away. Jazzman with a membership. Appreciate that. Whenever someone tells something mid, it means they literally have nothing to say. Yeah, generally. I mean, it's just, it's, it's about, it's about elaborating, you know? Perfect example. So we were just playing all those Metroidvanias, and that last one, I was like, hmm, this is kind of mid. And someone was like, what does that mean? i say, well, the, the start of the game was rather mediocre compared to the other two Metroidvanias we played. We have a very slow start that's just a focus on jumping around and hitting. Uh, the graphics take on a kind of basic animation style that almost mimics Cuphead, but it doesn't have the same level of tightness that that one does. Uh, overall, just the, the jumping, the animations, the you know, walking, the fighting, all of it seems like it is at a rather mediocre level. That is what's constituting it as mid. But that's the thing. It's it's about expanding on that. You're just gonna say something's mid, you gotta elaborate. Oh uh, dude, people were so butthurt over Wild Hearts and that game was great. The biggest problem Wild Hearts had was its absolute terrible performance at launch, which unfortunately kind of buried it alive. Parrot clowns. They repeat the trending words without any elaboration or expansion. I like that term. I'm going to use that. Parrot clowns. All right, hold on. I'm tracking too much shit in the map right now. Um, where is the long gun grinder? Oh, no, we don't need this. We want this. See, this is a little confusing because I've hit track. But there's like 80 fucking icons on the map, so I'm not sure where that is. This is this what I want? No. Oh wait, yes. That has. Wait a minute. They have brandy, wine, and torsion spring. What do I need exactly? Wood tar. So no, they don't have what I need. It says I'm tracking it, but I don't know. Is this it? Dragon's back. Okay, never mind. So these are the areas that have it. So I can get some right here. It looks like. All right, let's set sail. Uh, you can hunt sharks. I have no idea what you get for hunting said shark. Those are my normal. I think these are my quick cannons. I'm 
pretty sure I put him on my starboard side. Yeah, I did. Oh, that's gonna be nice. So, can I just, like, shoot people? No, okay, so people, so... Yeah, we're not flagged for PvP. Got some food. This place got hit hard. Oh, they have it. Wood tar, limited stock one. Be stocks in two minutes. Uh, I ain't got the money to buy it. I'm broke. I just need to find people that have that flag. PvP is optional. Dolphins. I'm just waiting for them to repair this place and I'm gonna take it out. And then I'm gonna upgrade my long guns. Actually, I should go get the, the ship. Where's that ship that I was tracking? Where's that ship? The Hulk. Purchasable. Man, I ain't got the money to purchase it. So we're gonna have to hit this place before I can go purchase anything. What's in the world? Is that red water? I think that's... That ship might carry sweet loot. It may have what I need. Don't sink. Oh, come on. I missed it? No, come on. Oh, I think I got it. As it was about to go down. You can only walk on land to, like, go to town. You don't... You don't actually, like... You don't like board ships and fight like it's Black Flag and that doesn't happen. Any con- all combat for the game takes place... Uh... On your ship. Alright, and this is almost up, so we can pillage this. Hopefully that gets the stuff I need. I can make my long guns. This game definitely would eat up a lot of time, though. Like, just just hunting out for the, the materials that you want to make your stuff. You could... You could very easily stream this for a long time. I wonder how they're going to instance it, though. Because one concern is if this is like a... Like, so far, every time, the, the two times I've gone to pillage something, somebody else was already there. Or it had, it had recently been pillaged.
Plunder! I think I got that one. <laughs> yeah, like the combat and the boarding and all that is very straightforward. I better get the stuff I need. So where you aim, it seems like you need to actually aim that rope and try and land at least one on the ship to get the board. I came here, still have not gotten any wood tar. Those are really good as like a quick side shot. decade to make the game is honestly irrelevant to the, the argument when 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 people say oh the game took a decade to make it didn't it wasn't actively in development for a decade it's not how it works 
That time frame can include prototyping, ideas, storyboarding. It's not like for 10 years people were coding things. Oh, it's gonna be bad. Oh. Looks like they died before I could get the board off. Damn thing, I'm trying to board it. Ready to fire! Got it. Damn. Give me your shit. We should probably gotta go. Is this what I want? Of a steel wood tar. Wood tar. It said this has wood. Tar. Oh, you know what? It does have wood tar. It's the limited supply wood tar. Oh. Well, I guess I can just buy it. I'll buy it. Sell them back all the shit I just got them. <laughs> I see you're out of ale. A pity. Kind of fucked up. That's worth less. Worth less here. Wood tar, limited stock, out of stock. What's the respawn time on it? Restocks in 29 minutes. Oh. Get moving, you rascals. World of Warships Pirate Edition? No. No. There's a lot of, uh,. The best way to think of this is if you take the combat from Black Flag but you put it in a game that's it's basically an, an RPG but we're playing as a ship. Oh, 
Hunning had a face and he went to a lot of green. Let's go for I mean, I'm having fun crashing ships and pirating. I'd be curious to see how this turns out at launch, but right now, it, it took a bit, but this has grown on me to where I would probably play this at launch and just go around pirating people. Pirating people is pretty fun. Because the idea of like figuring out what weapons I like the most and upgrading and single player boat RPG, I mean if you're keeping PvP off, yeah, might as well be. I am uh, almost three hours into the game. This, this place has a whole ass navy. The level 10? Yep, not gonna fucking uh, shoot you. I'm just sailing on into trade. Man, that shit is very limited. God damn. Let me go look at this ship with the white sails. It's a merchant, but it's only level 9. Or it's level 9, but it's a merchant. Do you think these dudes are going to attack me if I attack it? Alright, this one's farther away from them. I'm gonna... We're gonna attack this one. Well, you ain't gonna see PvP, Ronan. Because I don't even know how to turn it on. Oh, there's a level 10 that's already attacking it. Snipe its goods. Yeah, I'm not supposed to be fucking with this dude. Holy shit, he hurts. Yeah, I ain't no way I'm killing this dude. Not without the other guy's help. Also, level does make a significant impact on... Whether or not you're gonna have any chance. Let's go make our long guns. Actually, how much money do I have right now? Damn it, wrong button. Oh, purchasable in the Black Isles. Is that there?
After watching this, I think Black Flag is still the better pirate game. No swinging onto another ship and having epic sword fights or raiding forts with your raiding party. It's a deal breaker. So you're upset that the game doesn't have what it never offered to begin with. Got it. Cool. I do have those treasure maps. Let's see if any of them are... Scale, Islands of the Moon. I want to get my ship first. Ship looks like crap. I just want to sleep. They will be feeding the fishing. Vulcan calls for help. Nah. I gotta sail around this island. Raiding a ship should have been expected for ship battles like the very old Black Flag Flag. I disagree, man. Listen, we, we knew getting into this that this was inspired by Black Flag and supposed to be an emphasis around ship battles. Now, given that it's been in development hell forever, when, when, was that, when did they ever say that we were going to board ships and have sword fights? And honestly, it's probably better they didn't do that, because if they did, all of a sudden they need to not only work on the ship combat, which is the core of the game and the most important thing that needs to be good for this to be enjoyable and to sell, but they need to actually have engaging good melee combat. And I would rather have a game that has fun ship battles and an emphasis on sailing the ship than a game that has okay ship battles and janky Dark Souls sword fighting. Yeah, it was based off of the love people had for Black Flag ship battles. Black Flag's combat is just Assassin's Creed combat. Who do you know someone that's like, oh man, the on foot combat in Black Flag? That's what I played it for. You weren't there for the ship battles? Nah, nah, the ship battles that was okay. Bro, the raiding was the worst part of Black Flag. Come on, literally, you would you would hop on the boat, you'd like kill four people, and it was it. The ship battles, the legendary ships. Unlocking the stuff for ships. That's the stuff that was... That made Black Flag so entertaining. These guys are under attack. Am I coming in to save the day right now?
Bro, that tower is attacking me. What the fuck? I came here to save y'all. I'm saying you're asking you're you're you have an expectation for them to have improved upon something that was never gonna be part of the core gameplay. The whole idea behind this game was ship combat from Black Flag full-size game. That was the inspiration. We did it. That's what I'm saying, bro. Yeah, we didn't know it at the time they were hyping it. But you, you're, you're creating this false scenario in your head, and then you're disappointed that the game didn't have it. Oh man, it's gonna be a pirate game. It's gonna be just like Black Flag. It's gonna have raiding, and we're gonna assassinate people. But it's gonna be a big open world. Like you're in this scenario, you've set a false expectation, and you're upset that that expectation was not met. I'm saying that doesn't make any sense. It'd be one thing if they said outright, like, we want this game to basically mimic everything Black Hat Flag had, but make it better. Okay. Well, now we're looking at just shit battle, and they were talking about making everything Black Hat, but everything Black Flag had, but better. That's not what we got here. But that's not what they said. Fancy a trade? Tunga Su, you have come to the right place. If you seek solace from we are the steep. Many of us. Here we do we well. Yes, there's she shanties. Oh, I got I got 22 of these, bro. Oh my god. Big money for that ale. Jesus. See people. You got water barrels. You ain't got the stuff I want. I don't know if it'll be streamed with the boys. Depends on the boys. Found in Red Isle, purchasable from Pharaoh Warrior and Sacred Tree. Oh, treasure chest. Damn, 2200 silver. The game looks like total shit and extremely outdated for AAA company. No, you're a fucking idiot. Stop talking. This looks like total shit. Bro, holy fuck. Go get a reality check. some powder on this bitch. Right, I gotta find this warrior, dude. 
assume he's like near the tree. Let me see. Yeah, that was a Twitch comment. So that'll take me down. Barrel Warrior, you were the one we need. We took a large prize. Tearing Culliburn. Good performance in terms of range, damage, and reload. Upgraded a fire chain shot, which effectively since the hills will. Long gun, the Hulk. Damn, it's expensive. Hmm. Hmm. Increased damage by 50% when hitting sails. That sounds cool. And I already got the stuff for a better long gun, so we ain't buying that. Bombard tier 2. Uh, yes. May enemy guards tend drowsy in your presence. All right, I got what I want. How expensive is it to fast travel back home? Oh, 285? Easy, let's go. of your actions have reached So our captain swings about in a boat. Why, if I still have to keep that, the price of your Moving up in the world, I see. With the right designs, I can improve your vessel. So do we want Defender? Yeah, I mean, this does get uh, a stern gun as well. And it has way more health. 8 and 10. 8 and 12. Cargo, 20,000. Cargo, 46. Bro, we're going for Hulk. Make my new ship. Okay, so we did that. Travels, We're gonna go to the blacksmith man. Moving up in the world, are you? Yes, sir. No, fuck! I used my bronze ingot making the damn ship, and I can't make my long gun. That is whack. Bombard tier two. I would need four for that. Four for that, so that's eight. And then, uh, what did I get? This. And eight for that. Oh my god, I need 16 bronze ingots, bro? Fuck me. I think I can craft some. Wait, you need more wood tar? No, 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 no. Hang on. No, nah, we're good. Two wood tar. That's cog wheels. A glowing ember is easier to rekindle. No, I do not need wood tar. Let's keep our business. I think I can refine bronze ingots. Never a day goes by without a sailor singing your name. Can't tell if they're cussing or praising. Bronze ingots. Refined from copper. Raw materials. Copper. Skurlock is married to trouble. He's a crop. I'm starting to... Alright, so I either need active item filter. Bronze ingots. 
So there's a supply route for them that way. What about copper? Just actual copper. Bog iron. Hang on. Can you refine copper from bog iron or something? Don't you worry. I won't be going anywhere. Copper. Where do I get copper from? Sock. Ah. Sailors post about their ship size all day. But it's how you steer. Active item filter. Knowledge. Codex. Uh, raw materials. Copper. Found in Red Isle. Harvested from metal deposit with a pickaxe. Okay. I need... If you need it, my hand can make it. Ooh. I have the tier 2 pickaxe already. Alright. May your travels lead you to warm sands. What's happening, Coop? Doing a little bit of pirating. Think we could use more repair kits, Captain. Yeah, we could. I'm fucking broke. Nah, I'm not sure how to flag for PvP. So I've just been grinding out a ship, figuring out what weapons I like. Pirates speak of your exploits. Skipper. I figure that's probably the. Uh, Stock up on repair kit. Figure that's probably the best way to spend my time is. Never stops moving, figure out what early ships I like. Figure out what weapons I like, and then go from there. So long as the sea people remain at war. Alright, cargo. Those two. We also want those and those. Luck can only get you so far. You need to keep hunting, stealing, growing. Uncut ruby. Trades beyond the Indian Ocean. All that stuff that I'll sell. This is stuff that's for sailing. That for the sea people. Okay, I want to manage my ship. So, weapons. On the bow, bombard. I know cannon balls are heavy, but we should keep a decent store on board. Seems like you're starting to get the hang of things. On the back, just drive by, hit him with the ass. Alright. Or you know what? I feel like I should put... No. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Attachments. Not available. Put that on. Ship cosmetics. Oh. Like that. Uh, you can't afford this, rip. I got a mermaid lady. The real end game, the transmog. <sighs> okay, cargo, no cannonballs, no bombard balls. All right. Damn, it's all the way over there? Bruh. Wait, hang on. It looked like there was multiple. 
There's two things of copper. One. Oh, so they're both like right there. Shit, 285. I can almost fast travel. I gotta sell something to fast travel out there. I am broke. You got more business for Mako Lacey? Yeah. Stay vigilant. A shark never sleeps. All right. Oh, shit. I did not mean to do that. The mail got new tools. I have the tier two already. I can check mail real fast. I don't have another furniture I can put in that slot, as far as I can tell. Increasing slow and steady wins the race. Oh, crowbar three. There we go. There's a minor furniture. Let's see if I can make the th tier three crowbar, I'll do it before I head out. I can remember where the hell to go. The Bombard one, I thought that was a major. I'll take a look in a second. Let me see if I can make the crow. No, the pickaxe. My forge is at your service. Nope, not you. You're not so bad for a rogue. Nope, not you. You met Scarlock? I've never had the honor. You must be important. No, fine Sissel Lime. Ain't happening. Yeah, fast travel. If you wanna, if you wanna travel, you gotta pay the price. So rope blocker is on. Area of effect. I think this is. Is this considered a major? No, it's not. So ten percent repair or ten percent AOE. Can't afford any of those. We're coming into our own, eh? All right. Let's go get ourselves copper and make all of our shit. I'll kill people. The winds favor you. Flamethrowers? I don't think we're gonna get that. Alright, where's my copper rat? Hit them in the ass when they're chasing us. You can get flamethrowers? Oh, okay. Well, fuck. Thought that was a joke.
Coop, do you want to join my pirate crew? I need I need pirate homies. Wait, what was the, the plunder notification for that ship? Oh no, it's for that town. Damn, ain't no copper left here. I'm enjoying it so far. Oh yeah, I don't want to fight. Attack that. Yeah, okay. I attack that dude. These towers are gonna get all uppity. This is the biggest thing I'm I'm concerned about with it being open world, though. Is like, if you're trying to just go get materials, I feel like it's gonna be. I feel like material farming is gonna be incredibly fucking contested and limited. Because we're sailing by the copper right now. And we ain't getting shit. The wind is ours. Which I don't know if it's like instanced to where like there's only X amount of people in the world with you at a particular time. But respawn rates on mere, uh, materials definitely seem... A little rough at the moment. Yeah, honestly, each material exhaustion per player would, would be good. Because that just means there's more people you could potentially pirate to get the materials from. But like right now, you know, right now I'm trying to get copper. There's seemingly no copper over at the only copper deposits I have on the map. And uh, no players. Copper, active item filter, copper. Yeah, I don't know how we mine it. I'd assume it's the same as the other stuff. Harvested from a metal deposit with a pickaxe. Unless I need to have, like, a tier 3 pickaxe, but... That, uh... The higher tier pickaxe requires materials I haven't even seen before. I mean, these, clearly this is copper deposits, but... I'm not getting anything harvested. I'm just kind of going between them. Oh, I made a goof. Oh, there I go murdering again. Ow, asshole. Chase me, chase me, ha ha ha. Ready to shoot, 
is my ass shotgun. I guess this guy doesn't have front guns. The Elden Ring leak was not accurate. It's not coming out then. I don't know how to aim this. Oh, it's mortars. I thought it was... Never mind, I'm using the... Bro, I don't want to be here. There ain't no copper here. What the fuck? Why, why ain't there no fucking copper here, bro? We're gonna have to. We're just gonna have to go get the uh, the bronze ingots, I guess. Uh. Okay. So. Journal, bronze ingots. No, no, wait. Bronze, 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 bronze. Bronze ingots. Let's all go over it. Go to your battle station. That's what happened. I need so many brown zingots though. On the horizon, <laughs> brown zingots as trade. All right, we're gonna go after the. No, I don't even think I can do that trade route. Isn't this trade route like going through areas where I don't fucking belong? Entering the Reef Sea. I'm just sailing the trade route over to that area. I mean, I was fine just getting the copper, but couldn't find any copper, and I ain't seeing any trade ships out here. Clan of Pharaoh.
I mean, nobody on this trade route. And I could go back and look for copper. There's got to be somewhere else I can get copper. This gets boring. Don't anyone put allower hours in this off stream? Yeah. I don't think you understand how video games work, Jamie. It's uh, it's kind of games in general. Give me your copper. Damn, that tower sniped me? Bro. Towers are bullshit. All I need is copper bars, man. I see some copper bars so I can try out the long guns. I feel like I'd rather have my, my shotguns on the front of the ship. And then, uh, this on the back so I can, like, mortar people as they're chasing me. So, I guess, I wonder if this is just cut off for the beta and this actually is, like, a huge fucking map. Y'all look like you're doing trade routes. Are you a trader? Broadsider. Yeah, I'm supposed to be on a trade route, but I ain't seeing no damn traders out here. It's even showing. Look, this is like this is the copper. This is the the bronze ingot trade route. Oh, that's one. That's a merchant. Oh, I'm gonna fuck him up. Come on, buddy. Come here. Stop, 
No, shit. Oh, oh well. That's two bronze ingots. I was about to board him, but it, it disappeared, so I figured I couldn't. We're just going to travel this whole trade passage looking for... Because what did I need? I needed like 18 bronze ingots. I needed a bunch. <laughs> nah, what? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm just pirating. What do you need me to wrap up? Oh. Alright. Like... Now or like shortly? Yeah, I can wrap up then. According to me, that is an outpost. We got 20 minutes of pirating left, chat. I think the white ships are merchants. That one's, I think, is sailing away. really gotta hope these people don't decide to fuck me up. East. I just straight back east. Yeah, that's the route. Okay. What are you? Level five. A burner. I don't know if I want to mess with that. No, yeah, I do. It's like almost dead. Shit, that was a big whiff. I'm dead, I think. Yep, damn. That last whiff kind of cost it for me. And yeah, that was a flamethrower. That shit hurt. Time limit is lame. Yes, God forbid. God forbid Ubisoft doesn't let you play the game an infinite amount of time for free. How dare they. Thank you. 
Bro, it's almost dead. I want to kill it. There's also a merchant right there. I think that's a merchant. Oh god. No, 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 no. Oh, that juke. Speed. Gotta find some more traders. That's seven. Seven bars and a thousand. I'm I'm broke. I need a better uh a better scope thing so I can see farther. funny I was just talking about how I needed a better spyglass and I just got a thing for spyglass too yeah those dudes really want me Keep hitting the wrong button. How, how are we on time? Two hours and 30 minutes. Oh, they finally fucked off. Jesus Christ. I think I can... I can at least try out the long gun. I don't know if I'm gonna have. I might be able to just sell sell a bunch of shit because the beta is gonna end every anyway. So I'm gonna sell everything I can to get the guns and try out the guns because that way that's the biggest thing right now. I should I should figure out you know what what are the guns that I want. What are the guns that I like? Because once I figure out the guns that I like. For launch, I'll be able to be like, okay, we are going for long guns, and I want the sail terrors, or whatever. You know, we'll be able to, to prioritize shit, so. That is, that is our priority. I like those. These seem nice as like a chase option. I kind of like the, the shotgun on the butt, just so I can do little drive-bys like that.
four. That's what I'm talking about. Hey, what though? These guys don't got a lot of silver. I think it's another one right there. <laughs> no, that's different. I got four repair kits, but I'm missing about 20% of my health. Let me see. So I was gonna make you so I got four for you. I was about to make you. Well I know how am I using Bombard right now? So I know how that works. So four for you. And then what about the special one? Eight. So if I get one more, I can try out the sail tearing. One more, I can try out sail tearing, and I can try out a uh, long gun. And they have six, so that's perfect. Uh, sure. Give me some money. I got a dock to fast travel. The closest dock would be, uh... Probably that place? Now, let's make it back to base. I just need to get to a dock and I can fast travel home. Skullock's wake is not the only place in the ocean to snare prey. Hey boys. It wouldn't take that long to head back. I think I can dock here. I'm not sure. Buy ingots here. Trade your wares of force. All right, so that's just like an encampment. Maybe I can dock at Temia Town? No, probably not. I was getting into ow, 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 we're going. Fucking towers, bro. This would end up being a stream thing. I wouldn't. This wouldn't make sense for episodes. I'd be like, In this episode, we're going to go get iron, you know? Damn, are they on my ass? Oh, it's the fucking towers. They're like throwing spears from way over there, bro. Crazy. I just want to get home and try out my new stuff. Come on.
We got our resource. We're not hunting anymore. We're just trying to head back to base. But I've pissed off like half the ocean, so... We're sailing instead of uh, fast traveling. I mean, I could land there and fast travel, but at that point, it's like I've sailed most of it. I want a ship add-on that just picks up all the shit. Oh, what's this? Ton of shit right now. I am currently rating it as fun. Company fishing boat over there. I got no, it's not worth the time. Isn't this ship supposed to like? Slowly regenerate health or some shit like that. What is it? Gee, people about you excited. What the hell? Come on, fire! We are ready for l'abordage, capitaine. All we gotta do is make it back. Crafting our guns. I hope I have the money. I ain't talking about Outer Wilds. If I say anything about it, someone will try and spoil shit. I'm kind of curious to see what, like, super high-tier ship- Can we look at- at smithing plans? For, like, super high-tier ships? Dishing out fire damage. Sam Bunk. Swift Ram. Reduce damage from ram by 45%. When you apply the ablaze effect to a ship, apply to all enemies in a radius. Multiple enemies when properly equipped. Explosive hits have a 70% chance of triggering an explosion. That sounds cool. I want one of those. Character creator? I mean, it's it's a couple options. It's mostly irrelevant. This is the only time your character matters is when you're walking around in town, which is like, hey, look, I'm a person. Like, it doesn't matter. Or if it kills, I can make it. All right. Long gun tier two. Fuck. Roko planks. Let's keep our Hang on. I think I have a Roko wood. I might be able to just make planks. Come to Vera for a good service. 
No. I'm short. I don't have those logs. Fuck. So long as the sea people remain at war, Skurlock rakes in the profits. Seems like you're starting to get the hang of the range on that thing. That's just boosh. On the butt, we're gonna do bombard from the booty. Debbie Cannon on starboard. I wanna try out the sail cutter. All right, so where is it at? It's all over there. Defended place of trade. Mm. How much money do I have? Can I just fast travel, buy one, fast travel back? That's what we're going to try and do. I got 2,000. Yeah, we can do that for sure, dude. We'll go south. We'll trade. We'll buy two. Swing back, and then we're good. Yeah, I already said, I don't know how to turn on PvP. I don't, I don't know how you do PvP. Time with some gift subs. No, British, I do read chat. It's just I'm not responding to a dumbass question. Especially not because you want to be a smartass about it. What I need, let's go. Get moving, you rascal. Face, do you know how to turn on PvP? Just trying to get destroyed. Especially because I'm pretty sure he doesn't know what the fuck he's talking about either. He said if you go into the options, there's automatic pickup. Let's go into settings. There's auto harvest, which makes harvesting slower. Let's see. Is there auto pickup? There's no auto pickup in this category. Movement stick, aim assist. Mm, see any auto pickup in the control settings? Let's see about interface. Hmm, nothing in interface. It wouldn't be in graphics. 
Third party, extend view while aiming. It's all Toby Gaming. Thin UI, MSI. Oh, would you look at that? There is no auto pickup, you fucking jackass. Come in here, talk shit, get upset when I ignore your comment, which is not even correct, and then you say I'm toxic. You just fucking dropped your pants, showed your whole ass to chat, and then got upset that people made fun of it. Looking like an idiot. The sacred tree. Their seer conducted. Yeah, oh no, I'm gonna ban this one myself. Listen to me, listen to me. You're not listening to me. You're toxic. Get fucked, idiot. Like, for real, if you're gonna come in and try to backseat, before you can get upset about me ignoring you, you at least, at least, gotta say shit that's correct. You can't come in, backseat, incorrect information, and then be upset when you get ignored because your shit isn't correct. Gotta be the smoothest fucking shit I have seen all night. Listen to me. Listen to me. Luck can only get you so far. You need to keep hunting. All right, all right, all right. Let's see. So we got our long gun on now. We got our. Let's try this. Tearing. Culliburn. Culliburn. All right. So this is supposed to. 50% when hitting sails. I feel like that's something I might want to put on the front of the ship, but we'll find out. Let's just set sail. We are dual streaming, yes. Let me pick up the, the bounty. That'll be a good way to wrap up the stream. Uh, about the same. Yeah, just hold the track. Damn, one won 7,000. Where's the other one at? Oh man, they are equally far as fuck. Oh. Oh. Dude, that's what I don't get, Emperor. Like people people come in streams with like the biggest expectation of like you're gonna you're gonna individually read every single comment react to every like no dude fucking 800 people here leaving comments i'm not gonna like could you imagine lol classic how are you liking the game so far good what does he expect yes i am toxic i'll stop the stream and delete the channel thanks for the stuff haha <laughs> have a good night y'all soccer games okay happy bye and he dislikes about it yeah there's a few things i don't like the line the witch and the audacity of the bitch haha <laughs> that's so funny just just them says pine i watched the video that summed it up as black flag with it like fuck that who is going to do that? No one's going to do that. They like got a fucking auctioneer. Let's go. Why not? It's closer than the other ones. Wait, is it? Turn it around. Turn it around.
I will probably be playing this at launch. I think we're on a... I'm going to head straight up for that. I'll probably intercept it. Indeed, very low tolerance for stupidity. <laughs> I wonder if these storms can, like, fuck you up. going nowhere. Lo, that shredded the shit out of that thing's sails. Sailing to the storm. Yeah, I think we're, we're doing that right now. Storm can damage you. Well, if I want to catch them, we have no choice, mites. We're going into the storm. My food buff is running out. Yo, honestly, this would probably be good as a, uh, as a tail end. Just because if people are chasing me, I could just, like, fire some of those. And then it's like, Lamau. Nice sails, idiot. briefly saw a flash of that thing's level and it's red who the fuck why are you out here chasing me bro bro bet this is where like the pvp shit's got to go down you got to time your shots on the waves and whatnot that's gonna be nutty I do not want to ram into you. Last thing I need to do is start a battle with a bunch of level 10s while I'm out in the storm. If there is big ass monster stuff, align your ship's bow or stern towards the wave and brace. Oh shit, boys! My little dingy would have gotten fucking shredded. I can see them. They're in the distance. We're gaining on them. You sail into the wave, bro. That's how it doesn't kill you. Haven't you ever done that? You go down to the ocean and you jump into the wave. It's fun.
Oh, dude, no way. There ain't no way we're pulling this off. The idea is like you're, it's like you're cutting through a wave. Oh, there ain't no way. These things are like level, oh, these things are, I can briefly catch them. They're level 10, level 12. Why am I out here? It's like a world boss, like a raid. Fighting cowboy, more like fighting Jew boy. More money this dude gets, more smug. Wow, bro, imagine coming in with an anti-Semitic remark because you got kicked out of chat. Holy shit, that is a fucking amazing reach. Enjoy your instant ban, holy shit. What an absolute piece of shit. Also, just for the record, I don't I don't know where this meant to, like I have always been an asshole, bro. I've had a couple of people that are like, you got big and it went to your head. Like, no. 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 Go go watch the old Dark Souls 2 stuff. I've always been an asshole. The only thing that's changed is I'm less willing to put up with your bullshit. I don't know what fucking channel you thought you were watching. This has never been Cowboy's happy time friendly hour. Getting out of this, getting out of the storm is an ordeal. Thank you, Chris. I haven't even got to use the long gun, but. Level 8? Yeah, I ain't getting involved in that fight. We already learned the hard way that... That, uh, fighting stuff a higher level than you does not work out. Oh, they'll probably come to Twitch. Dude, there's this, there's this one troll that... I, I can always tell it's him because it's always, like, some gibberish fucking name. Like, Christopher Staphylopinopagus. Francis... Meningi ideas or so he always makes up names. They're always letter accounts That have like, you know one week sub history when you ban them And it's this one dude that's fucking obsessed with me He has been around for like years now I can I can uh, I've gotten pretty good at being able to tell when it's him Which that last one more than likely was him because he always comes in with with some anti-Semitic remark about me being Jewish for some reason. I don't know. But it, it always cracks me up, dude. Like the it's it's funny to me that I got this man so fucking heated from holy shit from just playing video games. I don't know what that was. That was nuts. But just playing video games, I got this man so heated that he spends hours, hours of his life making accounts to sit and chat and then try to troll and then get and then get uh, kicked out like it's a it's a constant and it's fucking it's wild to me dude it's like that's an unhealthy obsession right that is like, you need to go fucking talk to a therapist. Like, the, the simple interaction would be like, you go to someone's chat, they boot you out, and you go, fuck that guy, and you move on with your life. 
That's what a normal person would do. Not make fucking 10, 15 accounts and then keep coming back because I don't, because he's obsessed with me. Like, oh, I oh, kind of curious what those guys killed me with. All right, we're finally out of the bad storm. Well, that's the thing, though. I have to ban him because every time he shows up, every time he tries to talk, it's always... He always he always goes over the line. He always tries to make, like, an anti-Semitic comment or he tries to, like, say shit about my kids. He's a fucking... He's, like, he's a veritable fucking weirdo. Damn, this thing has a fucking sniper. You see that fucking snipe with the long gun? Holy shit. Alright, long gun is fucking good, dude. Holy shit. I managed to snipe that weak point. So those aren't going to do good as a behind thing. Dude, the oh my god, the long gun snipes are so good. I'm going to die, but I feel like, uh, I might want to do, I might want to do a long gun on the front and the back. Because the, that's the sniping potential of it, like something's chasing you and you can hit its weak spot. That would be nasty. The sail destroyers, those were really good too. Torpedoes, ah, I don't have enough time, I gotta wrap things up, gotta help get the kids to bed. But the, uh... Yeah, that, the, uh, yeah, double long gun could be just... Because it, it, it's the accuracy of that. Like, that one ship, dude, that one ship was, like, 90% health. And I hit it, and it was like, boom. Like, I hit something. And usually trying to hit those weak spots is actually pretty fucking hard. So, if it has that kind of accuracy... Render ships vulnerable to crew attacks. A part needs steel nerves. Great at ripping holes in enemy holes and causing them to be flooded. That sounds really good. So in turn, I wonder what the enhanced long guns look like. Cripple many a ship, dismantling their masts before the kingpin charges in for the kill. So we can just straight snipe a mast with this thing and just take it down. So if I do that, I think I think we would go... Oh, how do the torpedoes? Devil's torpedoes do double damage after being armed. Cannot target structures. Yeah, I don't know. I might go long gun front, long gun back. Like the bombardment? Bombardment would be okay on the front. Because I could snipe towers with them. But the long gun felt really good. That's 2904 on this. It's like 4000. So I might go like bombard. And then like a long... I don't know. Long guns were nice. There's so many weapons. Rockets, mortars, ballista, sea fire. There's definitely going to be a lot to, to figure... Test out and whatnot. I would have to get up to Brigand, and I do not have enough time to pull that off. So, 
Either way, we're going to wrap things up here. Uh, yeah, first impressions for this are positive. I think I would play this. I would play this at launch, but I would definitely want to have a crew to sail the seas with. I think having like a, having like a three-person crew to swing around and, and blow shit up would be a lot of fun. So we're going to close out here uh, tomorrow, probably checking out Rogue Trader finally, because I've been sitting on that for a bit and I want to get to it. And then, uh, yeah, we'll knock that out. And then from there, either more Rogue Trader or possibly God of War. So 